Hey guys, Doug B here. I recently had a request from Skip Bass to go over global custom scales. Like me, he had bought some presets from Moke and uh, he could not get the global custom scales to work right. He said the harmonies always sounded wrong. So he asked if I could go over them. Now for me, I got a hold of Moke and found out what I was doing wrong. Uh, I was using it in the preset for Boys Are Back in Town. And once he gave me some direction, works great. But what are global custom scales? How do we use them? Global custom scales are used in the pitch block in conjunction with the custom shifter type. It allows you to create harmonies outside of the standard predefined scales that are used by the dual diatonic type. Scale one and scale two. These select the custom scale to use for each voice. Custom scales are created on the scales page of the global settings menu under setup. You can also set these up and access it under the setup menu. Every custom scale consists of 12 values, one for each note in the chromatic scale, so the shifter knows precisely how to shift any note you play. For example, if you went to the C line right here and put in 7 and then played the note C, the shifter would produce a G, since G is 7 semitones above C. The range is two octaves up or down. Key. This transposes both custom scales to the desired key. All custom scales are assumed to have a root of A, so this shift is relative to that note. For example, if you wanted to transpose a custom scale down one whole step, you would change the key to G, since G is one whole step below A. In other words, you always program your scales in the key of A then you can use whatever key you want. For example, my old band plays The Boys Are Back in Town in the key of G, so I put in G in the key parameter. So how do you create and assign a custom scale? Custom scales allow a different harmony for every note you play. The first step is to work out what you play and the kind of harmony you want. If you're good with music theory and notation, you might just write it out and work out the intervals. If not, you can ask for help in the Fractal Forum, or do it by trial and error using your ears. Either way, you'll want to know how to set up and use a scale. Let's set one up. Okay, so first of all, you click on Setup in Axe Edit, go down to Scales. And for this one, we're going to use custom scale number one. As you can see, there are 32 different custom scales that you can use. All of them are set to zero semi right now. We also went into the pitch block and set the type to custom shifter, and we're telling it to use scale one. Now we go back to Setup, Go back to custom scale number one. You know, and right now, if you played something, you wouldn't hear any harmony because these are all set to zero. Let's see, so we find the note C. Let's change that to four. Now, if you play the note C anywhere on the guitar neck, you should hear the harmony, the major third. But first, set B to five, set A sharp or B flat to six, set A to three, set G sharp or A flat to four, Set G to 5, set F sharp, G flat to 3, set F to 4, set E to 8. So what I'll do is I'll play a slow descending passage starting from the C on the 8th fret of the high E string. And I'll play every note down the neck, one fret at a time, until I reach the open string. Getting a little glitchy on me. Custom harmony can be used for an infinite number of musical ideas. With two voices, the custom shifter can stack your choice of scales for different harmonies. And remember, the pitch block has four channels, so you can switch these harmonies on the fly, you know, like with a foot switch or with a scene change. I had mentioned that when I bought Moke's presets back in early 2020, 
the documentation for boys are back in town stated that you had to enter the global custom scales via the front panel. Sure enough, if you go into setup via the front panel, then go down to global settings, hit enter, and then page all the way over to the right, you hit scales. There are 32 custom scales available to use and Moke uses numbers five, six, and seven. There's 12 entries per scale and obviously they have to be entered exactly as Moak lists them, otherwise your guitar harmonies will be way off. Moak offers free updates, so I re-downloaded the presets that I had bought two years ago. When I read the updated installation notes for the boys are back, Moak mentioned using either the front panel or Axe Edit. I had no idea that the front panel setup menu could be found within Axe Edit, but apparently it had been there for years. The global custom table section was added back with Firmware 12, and I just found it last week. Moke also told me that you can now import and export global custom scales and that his updated presets now have the global custom scale files that you can simply upload. Wow, no more typing in all of that data by hand. But yeah, you again, you go to setup. Moke uses five, six, and seven. So if you go to five, click on this little downward triangle, you can export or import right there. You don't have to type that stuff in anymore. Sweet. Well, there you have it, guys. Using global custom scales to make harmonies that you create. And that's just one of 16 different types in the pitch block. Let me know if you'd like me to go over some of the different types, you know, like putting together a whammy pedal. And next Wednesday, we'll be looking at another preset of the week. You don't want to miss that. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. All right, guys. See you then.